thinking, who wants some soup? I know what you're thinking. The last thing you want in the middle of the summer is soup. Well, guess what? You're absolutely wrong because there are summer soups, which are actually cold. And I'm gonna show you how to make one that's not only delicious, but nutritious. And everybody that's going to have this is absolutely gonna love it. I guarantee it. We're gonna make Bloody Mary soup. And to get started with our starting lineup of ingredients, which in this case, it includes these little devils. Got yourself some diced, and I'm saying diced, not whole, not chopped, not pureed, diced tomatoes. You're gonna need a shot of Worcestershire sauce. You're gonna need to have some horseradish, one chopped piece of celery. I usually like to put a little bit of citrus in there, and I happen to have a lime left over from making our last dish, and hot sauce, in which case I'm gonna be using some Verity Blend from Howlin' Monkey, and you need some Bloody Mary Spice, which guess what? There it is, you can get it online. It's actually pre-packaged and ready to go. So let's whip it up. First thing we're gonna do, obviously, is we're gonna carefully, I don't wanna get this all over me, pour in the tomatoes. Gonna add in my celery. Gonna give it a little shot. Of horseradish again, you know, you can decide how little or how much. I usually like to add about a tablespoon. Gonna have us a little hit of Worcestershire sauce, a little hit of hot sauce, and last but not least, we're gonna add in some of our mix and a little squeeze of citrus. Why not? And then get ready, drum roll please. This is a very complicated procedure. And now for the moment we have all been waiting for. Really nice. But I am gonna add in a little bit of Himalayan salt. And just a little shot of pepper. Give it a little hit. Delicious! And again, this is one of those recipes that you get to decide how much spice, how much salt, how much Worcestershire, how much horseradish. Play with the mix. It's even better when you put it in the fridge and let it set up overnight. Just wonderful. So until next time, keep munching, folks. Bye from Man Cave Munchies.